am Madhura. Welcome to madhurasrecipe.com. Today we are going to see how to prepare batate chi khichdi or upasa chi batate chi bhaji. This is a typical Maharashtrian recipe which we generally prepare on the day we keep fast. You may also call this as very simple aloo sabzi but you are allowed to eat it on the day of fasting. This is really very simple and quick recipe. So let's get started. Today I am going to show you a quick and easy way of preparing this potato chip bhaji. We are going to cook this directly in the microwave. Now if you don't have microwave available or for any reason if you don't want to use microwave, you can simply follow the same process and steps and prepare this potato chip bhaji in pan over gas heat. Now to prepare this in microwave, first thing that we need is microwave safe pole. And in this first we are going to add some ghee. Here, ghee is nothing but clarified butter. Here I am using homemade ghee. Add in as much as more or less ghee you want. Here I am adding almost one tablespoon of ghee. And in that we are also going to add some cumin seeds. About half teaspoon. Just mix this up. First, I'm gonna microwave this ghee and cumin seeds together on high power for three minutes. Now, once we microwave this ghee and cumin seeds together for three minutes, next we're gonna add some potatoes into it. Now for this recipe here I am using one large size potato which I have boiled in pressure cooker, peeled it and I have cut this boiled potato into medium size cubes like this. Now uh, here you can see our ghee has melted and this uh, cumin seeds has also sizzled when I microwave it. Now in this I am gonna add this boiled potatoes. Also, we need to add this roasted peanut powder or coarsely ground peanuts. And add in some salt to taste, about half teaspoon. And mix this everything together really well. Then add coarsely ground green chilies or you could also add some chopped green chilies. Now mix this up. And now once we mix this roasted peanuts very well with this boiled potato. Now we are going to microwave this over high power for 1 minute. Now after we microwave this batata bhaji for 1 minute, take this out from microwave and give it a good stir. Well, you can see this potato bhaji is almost ready. This is almost cooked. Now, just the final step. I'm gonna add some finely chopped coriander leaf. It looks fabulous and it smells just awesome. Mix this up. It looks lovely. And now, again, microwave this for final one minute. And after we microwave this up finally for one minute, again give it a good stir. And you can see this potato chip bhaji or potato chip khichdi is all ready. You can see these pieces of potato, they have been well coated with these roasted peanuts. And it smells just fantastic, this aroma of roasted peanuts, oh my god, it smells heavenly. This potato chip bhaji looks great. I love the aroma of this bhaji. Awesome. Let me just taste it. Mm. It tastes fabulous. Wow. And how simple this recipe is. No any mess over gas stove or no need to wash any spoons or pans. And it gets ready in just 5 minutes. It goes really well as a side dish with some barecha bhat and amti or also with some sabudana khichdi. 
For such and more and more exciting recipes, please visit madhurazrecipe.com developing a new taste. See you soon. Bye-bye.